Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check the devices that are logged into your email. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. Now, whether you have Gmail, Yahoo, it doesn't really matter. The process is fairly similar. So I'm going to open up a web browser here on my iPhone. You can again do the same thing on Android or if you're on a computer. We will go to myaccount.google.com. So you can see here myaccount.google.com and hit go. So you're going to want to log into your specific account. Again, I'm walking you through the steps on Gmail, but if you have Yahoo or another email address, you can follow similar steps and just go to the settings or account page for that email. So now that we're in myaccount.google.com, at the very top, we're going to swipe over and tap on security here. Now that we're in here, we're just going to scroll down and keep scrolling until we get to your devices. And I can hit manage all devices. These are every single phone, computer, tablet, whatever it may be that's logged in to my email address. So you can see five sessions on iPhone and my current session at the very top. Now you can see three sessions on a Mac computer. This is my Mac computer right here. So you can see these various sessions. Of course, I can tap on any of these and hit sign out if I don't want them to have access to this email address. Now these are specific devices, but let's go back. I also recommend scrolling down and tapping on where it says your connections to third party apps and hit see all connections. Basically, what you're going to want to do regularly is confirm that you want to give access to your email address through these apps. So you can see one is Mac OS, which is okay with me. And the other one is my thermostat nest, which is okay with me. So you want to review any of these. If you don't like any of them at the very bottom, you can hit delete all connections. If you want to prevent that specific app or website from being able to be logged in and access your information on your Gmail. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.